they're doing this well, but I think you're this right. This is not, one of those not where many people have them in their predictions. The whole is greater than the sum of its parts. Absolutely. You know, we don't see these that phrase. pushing so this sense. far into like a 2v2 tournament or something, but 3v3, they just work so well together. And you can't discount the Luna factor, you know? Oh, man, never. You like, discount the Luna factor, that's a quick trip to the loser's just, bracket. <laughs> yeah, it's just Luna, Luna's a, a very winning person. But All right, so what do you make of the Great Hall pick here? How do you feel about this I stage love, in threes? I love the Great Hall in threes. I've, I've always thought Great Hall a little, a little big for 2v2. Nice weapon throw to interrupt. What? Okay. Um, yeah, a little, little big for 2v2, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Perfect for 3v3. It uh -huh. just, it just, it's, it's one of my favorites. Whenever I'm playing in the 3v3 queue, I look forward to ha having this one pop up. Yeah, this one is like, especially crazy because we saw a lot of matches just now on Black Art Keep, but here the damage piles up so much faster because everything is funneled yeah. towards that center stage where you have those right. scramble situations, and you've got those side platforms perfect for slide charging signatures in <laughs> right into the fray. True. I think the top platform does a lot for the 3v3 because it's almost oh, yeah. an entire extra stage up there, you know? The length of this stage is practically doubled if you're only counting that top platform. Yeah, and we've seen Walshi kind of doing a little bit of counterplay against that top platform. The Gauntlets, he'll ju dash jump in with a neutral air from the side platforms, perfectly scoops somebody Whoa. from that and throws them center stage. Yeah. Okay, a very small lead. No, th I mean, I don't know. Don't look at it too hard. This is a pretty much It's a little topsy-turvy at the game. moment. <laughs> Next knockout will determine it, and there it is. Cutie goes down. That's the lead now for Luna, Cody, and Java. Java scores oh, a nice yeah. knockout. Now they're up by two stocks. This is huge. Java finally goes down. Cody's the only one left with two stocks remaining. Keeping an eye on Cody here. He's getting hunted down. He's got no weapon. Cutie wants to take him out, but he snatches the blasters. He can uh -oh. get a lot done with these blasters here, especially off the edge. This is Cody Travis we're talking about. Cody with blasters in a team game mode? What? Are you kidding me? He just blasted all three players like so many times. Cody's and still survived. Uh oh, wait. Luna's That's the out. Cody classic. Luna's out. It's, uh -oh. oh, wait. It's getting out of hand. Oh, okay. no. This is a 2v3 that they need to win, that they, that they could win. I mean, you look how damaged that dog and cutie are. Yep, Java is, totally is the main doable. target to really just spiral this advantage. But Cody and Java, they can choose any target they Whoa. want. Oh, Cody, he landed the signature, but it's got such a long on hit yep. that it doesn't work so well in 3v3 when the opponents are so nearby. You they need just, a clear open window. Them. There's one. They might bring this 2v3 back. Now it's just a regular old 2v2. Down to the wire here. All players extremely damaged. This could go either way. Java lands a neutral light, gets punished trade for, for it. Trade for trade, for trade. Cody Travis is about to score a knockout. Oh. No, wait. He almost got knocked out himself. Blasted oh, the away. Blaster That's side the air has out. more range than the sword Get side air. Wins out, scores the knockout, and now we've got a 2v1. This is real class. This is winnable for Dog. Oh, no. Never mind. Woo. Cody and Java taking the win. You know, you know Cody's got to feel good about having Java on his team right now. Oh, yeah. It seems oh, like yeah. an unlikely duo. And, you know, it's – as I'm remembering – the uh, World Championship 2021, uh -huh. where they fought against each other in grand finals. Oh, yeah. Right? Cody Travis was absolutely slaying it. And there was really nobody else in the entire region of North America that was giving Cody even a little bit of a problem in that tournament, except yep. for Java. Java actually could have won that. that Java, oh, yeah. Java easily could have been the World Champion. That's how some of the best teams and friendships are formed, right? Where you're just like, well, uh, you were the only guy that was you're at risk for, of taking me yeah. down. What if you were just on my team? That then is, we don't have to worry about that. That is exactly. That is totally <laughs> how the best teams are formed. You're absolutely right. Like you are too formidable of an opponent. Instead of fighting you, how let's, about being a formidable let's team friend? Up. <laughs> oh, Luna! What are a combo. you serious? And Walshy too. Another one. Oh, what? that's such a powerful start for these guys. Yo. Wow. That was 30 seconds in. Three knockouts in a 3v3. That first knockout was like all oh, Luna. Just peak picked one target and he scored it. And now they're up three stocks. That's huge, man. What a great play by Luna. Oh, Woo! gravity cancel off the top. I'm but surprised wait. Java no, didn't get the knockout can't. on Cutie there. Uh oh, caught in the oh. crossfire. Cody falling down. Java Java's in dire in straits. 
Can he make Kate. his way back up on stage? No, no. sniped by Walshy. Oh. Perfect positioning. Great job by Walshy, Cutie, and Dog bringing it back here. Uh, that that this easily could have gotten out of hand, and now they they practically brought it back. I mean, the, the damage is there's still a damage differential to deal with, but wow, I mean, just evening up the stocks. When there's three stocks like that to even up, that's huge. Yeah, they kept the extra credit very minimal, but once the stocks are tied up now, Dog it Cutie Walshy. could have got out of hand. This is, this no, is hurting. This what? Hurting. Oh, are you? What? Java was the healthiest on the field. He got knocked out. Oh, that's big. That and is going to be a massive tied pivot. Up. It's like so tied up. Look at the top right. Screenshot that. It's like as tied up as it's ever going to be. Yeah, get the color pickle. Com compare those colors. They got the same hex code. Yeah, what's the hex code on that color? Whoa. <laughs> Oh, yeah, there's that reduced force on your teammate, making that absolutely worth it to it's, combo them both. Yeah, they are great at being mid-combo and, like, doing all the math and figuring out, is this going to be worth it, you know? Yep. Subtract the 25% less damage and force that you do on your teammate and then subtract. Uh oh Java <laughs> with the a save, save from Luna. Absolutely clutch. And Java needed that because he'd be out of the match right now if he didn't get saved. Now Luna Java's just... got to play real careful here. Uh-oh, see, that side light was not even worth it. He he can't do a move that's going to get him punished right now. He's got he's to come in and, and combo off of his teammates or save teammates from true combos. Yep. Uh -oh, uh oh Java's, and that's a stuffed recovery, Java's too. about to get knocked Java out. Java with the sweat beads, he's gone! It's up to Cody and Luna to win this 2v3. It's doable, but definitely a big advantage here for Dog, Cutie, and Walshy. Right, 3v2. Happen. You see the blue team just maintaining control of so much of that Whoa. center stage. Gets the almost the double. That worked though. He got he got him. And now it's just Cody Travis. And I would sure love to see an awesome 3v1, but that's that's not happening, TDK. It's not this game. It's not you know? happening. That does tie up the set though, and that's exciting. Ooh. One to one now. Right? I think I think a lot of people. Time skip? Yeah, one to one, right? Yeah. yeah. So a lot of credit has to be given to Walshy Dog and Cutie here because. I don't think anybody expected them to put up this kind of fight. Oh, yeah. They could win this whole thing. I mean, this is really just going to come down to how they play it because they got the great swarm. And against again, we're going back yeah, to great not ball. Enough. So I think this map really works well for their team play style. They keep Man. it pretty tight to the vest. They're great at saving each other, interrupting things. It's that amazing would really they brought that back. Do you do you remember the start of that last match when they were down by three, three stocks in thirty stocks? seconds? Like huge. It was a brutal start, and still they managed to change the tide. Cody Travis has taken a lot of damage here, but a great alley oop onto Walshy. Cody Travis has the opportunity here. He keeps getting knocked around though. Ooh, Cody setting up for some edge guards. He's got the bow to do it. It has a lot of downward knocking attacks. The side air, the down air, especially that ground pound. Ooh. Oh, it almost it almost slipped by me there that Ooh. Luna changed his legend. The Akuma now. Ah yes. I thought he was doing really great on the on the cannon. On Onyx. Yeah, it worked out really well. I guess, you know, he just wants a little bit of that extra movement speed so that way he can rotate through to his partners. He yeah, keeps the yeah. gauntlets from the Onyx, just, you know, something a little more stable with the sword. I'm, I'm thinking he's he's planning on getting a nasty knockout with a side stick off the corner with, oh, with, yeah. with the sword, yeah. Previous matches, we saw people using that same side signature phenomenally well, slide charging in from those side platforms. Yeah. Being able, uh, I think, being able to like rob stocks is huge in a three v three. If you got someone with a dunk, you got someone with a reversal, you know those uh, kinds yes. of things. If you can just score a knockout on someone while they're in white or yellow, oh, that could just change. And you can go everything. for those legend picks that might be, you know, not something that you'd see in like the two v two meta, but here in the three v three space, yeah, you know, you've got enough support in the back end that you can go for one that has those specialty picks. Something very specialized, something that doesn't cover all the bases, which you would kind of need in a one v one or even a two v two. But yep. when you're just when you're part of a team and you have one, you have a specific role on the team. You're right. That that is a good good way to do it. Cody Chav is down Ooh. to one stock. This is again perfectly even. What a what a game, man! What a matchup we've got here. Yeah, building on through Luna, taking oh. Walshy for a ride. Luna. Immediately swaps oh, over. Look at all this damage. What a combo! That was awesome.
Holy cow, Luna just popped off so hard. Woo. And after like six hits in his true combo somehow, <laughs> he, it was, was not true because he was just right. getting reads and stuff. Here's the thing, while she got the revenge with the knockout on Luna, but then immediately, Luna's teammate was there to support, mm. to take out Walshi, and now we're in that 3v2. Yeah, that fight, fighting with vengeance can land you in hot water. You know, you gotta keep, have, a, right. have a cool head. Cooler heads prevail. The man who seeks revenge had better dig two graves, right? Is that usually what Is they say? Is that the saying? That's yeah. A good, that's a good saying. That's a good saying. <laughs> you gotta keep a level head. <laughs> Oh Whoa! my gosh, oh, oh, how did you survive? Great Hall has a tall ceiling, but that tall? I was ready to pop off so hard for that knockout. Luna is lucky to be alive. Jeez. Well, I guess he's used to being up that high. You know, Luna the moon, he's in orbit, but not out of here. Yeah, right. He knows, he knows where orbit begins. <laughs> you know, he can feel it. Uh-oh, Java somehow surviving that one as well. I don't think he can take another strong oh, hit. Oh, man, it's a, okay. The trade-off, no, uh, what do they got? Oh, that was clean. That was so clean. That was nice. <laughs> <laughs> Two to one now in favor of Luna, Cody, Travis, and Java. Man, banning all the way down. We've got a little bit of extra information while we're checking these replays that it's going to be great haul again. <laughs> so you're getting a, a good preview of what the match is going to be like in just a couple seconds. It's funny how that happens a lot. Three, I think two, sometimes teams one, decide, like, four. you know what? That was a good game. Let's just run it back. I think we can beat you this time. Oh, yeah. They're, they're just like, change no other variables. We're just going to change our gameplay. We're just going to play better this time. Maybe a legend swap. Yeah, but even then, we, we don't even have a legend swap on this no, game. No, this is a full run back. Total run back. They just mash the rematch button. Let's go. <laughs> Cody Travis, he's hanging out on the outside. He's definitely like, this is my position. Some people play yeah. third base. Co Cody Travis. He's in the outfield, man. He plays man. outfield, yeah. He's, <laughs> he's got the range to do it. Look at, look at those blasters. Of course he can outpoke anybody. Cutie is the first one down to two stocks here. But everybody's extremely damaged. The stocks are about to fly. Oh, yeah. This is a house of cards. Look at him he tumble. He got a double knockout with one side sig. Nicely done. While she gone. Okay. Luna, dog, that's, when are you following your teammates? Yeah, that ties things up perfectly. Oh, oh, oh one. All the right. bottom side of the axe recovery. Dog now, just looking to extend. Yeah. He's the big dog. Big dog on the field here. The only one with all three stocks. Playing Bryn right now. Look at that. Oh, Extra you, credit, love man. Love to see that. These guys, that when they get their combo starter, they bail out of it. They they move and then try to follow up on it from a different angle it's because like, they know the punish is on the way. These Their opponents are so good at landing the punishes that you can't oh, yeah. go for the obvious follow-up. You've got to do, move yourself and go for a different follow-up. that boxing advice. Stick and move. Stick and stick move. Stick and move. Yep. Dog finally, I mean, so damaged before getting knocked out. He but look at the worth. He made that stock worth two stocks. That was a, that was a that was a nice two for one. That's a buy one get one free right there. In that time, they managed to take Java down to their final stock. Get Luna and Cody right on the precipice. Oh, what a beautiful save and interruption! But it can't save Luna for too long. These quick pivots, man. It's putting the red team on their heels. Oh my gosh, everybody up towards the top, off the top, no. All right, final stock starting to build. All eyes should be on Java. He is like that soft target right now. If he gets taken down, we're in that 3v2, which is so dangerous. Yeah, while she's still got two stocks though, and that's that's crazy. You got you got while Dunk, she's fighting gone. Java, and while she with two stocks takes out Java with zero, this could be the game winner. Wait, is that set count correct? Did Lu I thought Luna, Cody, and Java won the last one. No, I might be crazy. They're, they're fighting for victory here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> two to, 2v2, no, 2v3 still. While she has, is like so fresh on this stock. How are Luna and Cody? Okay, the set score was wrong. Okay, okay. the set score was all wrong. Right, okay, right. that changes the stakes here quite a bit. I think so Pingu was back there, you know, messing around with things. He's like, my <laughs> predictions must happen. <laughs> 
Uh oh, uh oh, big oh, hit. That, that changes it to a 2v2. Suddenly it's so winnable for Luna and Cody. They might not need to go to a game five here. They could just win it. Uh oh, uppercut. Nope, too tall of a ceiling. Axe side air not going to take out Luna. He's making his way back to stage, but Cody. Ah, avoided getting sandwiched in with just that falling side air. Dog lucky to be alive here, but now he's alone. Oh man, Cody and Luna are dominating the 2v3. Now it's just the 2v1. Uh oh, oh, Another side air. Woo. GG, Cody Travis, All right, Luna Cody, and Java damage? have just won. And your predictions continue Still to intact. look good. Still intact. Yep. Woo. Wow, GG. Unbelievable. Man, this was a hard-fought set. Yeah. Everybody putting, you know, Luna, Cody, and Java as their top seed. We thought it was going to be, like, kind of skating through until, like, you know, maybe winner's finals or oh, some trouble. While she dog and cutie, I don't think if we did, like, Twitch chat predictions, everyone would be like, nah, 80% the other way. Yeah, Come yeah, on. yeah. No. The, but uh, while she dog and cutie fought their hearts out. I think from here on out in the tournament, it's, it's pretty much a 50-50 Oh on, yeah, on every match at this point, it's really it's getting hard to predict. And everybody, that's right. you think the three v three, oh, you split it three ways. Dominate. That's a fifty fifty, and it's uh -huh. just doesn't really turn out. Because <laughs> math is for chumps. Math right? is for chumps, dude. That's yeah. Math is for chumps. By fifty fifty, I meant coin flip. It's like a coin flip. Yeah, you know? that's right. Yeah.